One evening, as was custom, several of the camp's men had gathered at my grandfather Sanford Scott's restaurant for a dinner of pig feet, boiled potatoes, turnip greens, and hot water cornbread. In attendance were Alfred Lee Jackson, Delmar Franklin, Ivory Earl Walker, and one Junior Watson. Junior's real name was Waddell Lewis Watson, Jr. His mother was Sheila May Watson, and she was married to Waddell Watson, Sr. However, Junior's natural father was Ely Lee Lynch. Junior did not like the name Waddell and said since he was named after his father, folks should call him Junior. Of course, some folks in the camp wondered if Junior would like the name Ely Lee. Mr. Watson Sr. was a short, big-boned man with bowed legs, paper bag brown in color with a wide nose and large, full lips. While Ely Lee was referred to as Shinola Black and probably six foot three inches tall, Reed Thin, as people used to say, with a long pointed nose and small ears. His ears stuck out sort of like wings from the side of his head. While not quite as dark as Ely Lee, Junior was over six feet tall. Reed Thin had a long pointed nose and small protruding ears. Granddaddy sometimes called Junior Ichabod Crane in reference to the Washington Irving character from Legend of Sleepy Hollow. While Waddell preferred people to call him Junior, to most folks, he was just plain old June. Junior was known throughout the camp because he was gullible and superstitious, especially after the death of his wife, Lucinda. Folks often said Junior's IQ was two points above a day-old dog turd. Granddaddy Charlie used to say, June's so dumb if he were a sponge and you throw him in the creek, he wouldn't absorb a lick of water. Junior was also legendary for his ability to consume pig feet in a clear homemade alcoholic beverage.